good morning children so yesterday we started we need water lesson no half of the lesson completed so once again i will say that okay so just listen carefully we need water yes we know very well without water we can't do any work yes so early morning we wake up after we are going to washroom so in that washroom we want water afterwards we wash our face we brush our teeth we want water okay so afterwards we face our face we wash our face okay so we need water we take bath we need water so afterwards we cook food we need water we clean the floor we need water so every work we have water without water we can't do anything okay so in our textbook so first of all water has many uses so first topic water has many uses so water has many uses so we know when well, drinking purpose cooking purpose washing purpose bathing purpose washing cleans vessels cleaning floor okay so animals also drinking water each and every work we are doing means mostly we want water okay so here we need water to drink okay first one drinking purpose okay drinking purpose we need water to drink next we need water to cook food okay so cook food without water we can't cook food okay so we need water to drinking purpose we need water to cooking purpose so we need water to bath so we need water to wash clothes okay so bath next wash clothes so washing clothes we want to wash clothes means we want to we need water so we wash the clothes next uh, we need to water to put out a fire okay sometimes fire accident happens means we have to call the uh, fire engine okay so in the fire engines they kept uh, they uh, send the water so water pipes very big water pipes have so we put off the water put off the fire with water very big water pipes pipes have in that water pipes water is uh, going on so when we are uh, call the fire engines means the fire means put out of the fire okay with water so put off fire okay so to put out a fire okay put out a fire so these are all our uses next where do we get water from so we get water where do we get water from so we get water from rain first of all rain only gives us water so rain falls on the lakes ponds rivers seas so then we will get water from these all uh, things okay so these all rivers uh, okay ponds uh, and lakes uh, so very big water place is the seas okay so first of all rain source rain is the main source so we get water from rain okay so rain falling in that lakes uh, rivers uh, so lakes rivers ponds like that so uh, we have to use that water so cleaning flooring purpose and we have to um, keep that water tanks okay so we have to save the water we have to uh, get this water rain water store in the drums uh, okay so water tanks like that so then it is sent to our uh, houses through pipes so actually a uh, very big tankers have means in the rain water one sent to the big uh, tankers in the tankers uh, all houses have the pipelines so we will get water from taps okay so pipelines only going on so uh, recently we took the uh, bhagiratha mission water no so 
water out. We dig the wells. So, bowl the pinch na puru, we will get that water. Okay, we dig the wells and we will get the water, underground water. So, like that we will get the water. Okay, so where do we get water from? We get water from lakes, rivers, ponds, okay, wells also. Like that. Next, saving water. So, saving water. We must save the water. So, sometimes uh, small children, they take the full glass of water and half of the glass only they drank and remaining water they kept like the tone. So, we waste that water. So, dust have means we don't drink that water. We pour the water. So, like that don't do. So, you want how much water means you have to take sufficient water only. Half glass means half glass. Full glass means full glass. Just you have to drink sufficient water. We don't waste the water. Okay. So, sometimes uh, when we are washing uh, our uh, brushing our teeth means we open the tap and we are brushing like this. So, don't do like that. Just you have to uh, after tap and after you are brushing just you have to pour slowly. Okay. Otherwise, you have to use mug. So, when we are using mug and bucket means we save the water. Shower and taps directly we are taking the bath means it is uh, based of too much water. So, better to use mug and bucket of water. So, it will save the water. Next, we must close the tap after use. Okay. So, we must take only as much water uh, in a glass we want to drink. Okay. You must collect rain water. So, we can use it to wash vegetables, clean the floors. So, you just you have to collect the rain water. Uh, uh, sometimes, our top of the top floor hangs the pipes hands just we have to uh, store the uh, rain water in the drums uh, or small small buckets like that so we have to use pour the um, uh, sometimes uh, we have to store the water we have to pour the plants otherwise you have to clean the floor okay like that just you have to use uh, another box so just you have to save the water so very small lesson this is our lesson okay so, just what is three topics only have? Okay. So, water has many uses. Many uses have. Daily we are using so many different different works. We are doing means we want water. So, where do we get water from? We get water from lakes, rivers, ponds, wells. Okay. So, sometimes uh, and actually, so very big uh, place of water where we have seeds only have. Okay. So, saving water. How we can save the water? So, just we have to drink sufficient water only. So, when we are washing clothes means sufficient water only we have to use. Don't pour the buckets, buckets of water. So, like that we have to save the water. So, important points in children. All living things need water to live. Okay, plants, animals, human beings, each and everyone want to uh, water, need to water. So, without water they can't live. Water is used for drinking, cooking, bathing, washing and cleaning. So many uh, uses. Rain water gets collected in ponds, lakes and rivers. Okay. So rain water get to collect ponds, rivers, lakes. We must not waste water. These all are important points. So just you have to observe the picture children. First picture the boy, uh, the girl drinking water. Another picture the girl pouring water, planting the water. Okay, so watering the plants, pouring the water to the plants. Animals also drinking water. Okay, cow or buffalo. I think. Okay, so next uh, many uses of water pictures I have seen drinking, cooking, washing clothes. Okay, bathing, putting out a fire. Okay, next. Uh, Cleaning a paint brush. So next, rain. We will get water from rain. It is a pond. Next, we must collect. We must collect rain water and we have to save. Okay, so we have to save the water. So, this is our lesson. So, important points have. So, hard words just you have to write children. 
very small lesson i already explained once again i am explaining today also okay children so we must write the hard words so just you have to write the lesson name we need water here hard words so today just i want to write the hard words but before only once again you are listening means you will recap that lesson that's why i explain once again so just you have to write the hard words okay children so drink food bath drink food bath clothes pants ground vegetables rain water floor children hard words drink food bath clothes ponds okay ponds rivers ground vegetable same water floor so 10 only have very easily you can learn so just you have to learn the spelling so okay children that is your homework learn and write seventh lesson hard words